What's going on YouTube? Uh, Uberman Tampa here. I had a video I saw yesterday on YouTube and it was of the CEO, Travis Kalanick of Uber, going off on an Uber driver. Uh, I'll post the link below and let you know when it starts because like the first over half of it is just him and two chicks. Um, completely disrespectful, absolutely rude, and totally unnecessary. Uh, this video went viral on Bloomberg, and he was forced to apologize. However, uh, some of the statements he made to the driver after the driver told him he lost $97,000 last year because of him, and he was bankrupt because of him, he said some people don't want to take responsibility for their own shit, and they always want to blame it on somebody else. Well, in this case, it was his fault because he did drop prices and the driver could not make ends meet um, based on the original agreed upon rate. So um, I found that really interesting and he later comes back with an apology saying that, you know, I need to be a better leader and learn how to grow up. Um, you know, This goes back to what I was talking to uh, talking uh, about yesterday with being respectful to other people. Um, he clearly thought that the driver was a piece of shit, and he clearly thought that you know the driver didn't deserve any respect, and he was just there to carry him around. And I also noticed he didn't tip. Of course not. You know, worth how many billions of dollars, and couldn't give him five or ten or twenty dollars. Yeah, typical. Um, but the way he spoke to him and the way he said, you know, what he said, it was completely out of line. And um, should he be watching this, you do need to lead a little bit better. You do need to learn how to run a business. Um, everybody knows Uber has all the markets and you could easily charge a dollar, dollar twenty-five for UberX and still get it. You wouldn't lose customers because they would either be forced to take a bus, which will take them three to four times as long to get to work. They would be forced to take a taxi they would be forced to buy a car which they can't afford or couldn't get because of credit and they would end up coming back. Um, you need to learn how to minimize the amount of drivers you're hiring instead of hiring a thousand drivers a day for various markets and flooding your market. People can wait five or ten minutes. They really can. And you, you have the opportunity now to change everything and become a strong industry leader instead of just an industry leader. And being a leader also means being respectful of people you work with, your vendors, your subcontractors, and your employees, instead of the whole sexual harassment thing. And that now this video, you are on your way to the toilet if you don't get your stuff straightened out. So that's all I have for now. I'll, again, I'll post the link down below and let you know when to start watching it. It's completely, it changes your opinion of him totally. Um, have a great day. Bye.